Okay, I'm Antonio Celli from University of Genova, Italy, and I work in the field of stem cells. And uh, I just want to, you know, give you a brief update about stem cell research in multiple sclerosis. I think that uh, in the last uh, uh, few years uh, we uh, really achieved a significant amount of data suggesting that indeed stem cells can be a treatment for multiple sclerosis. Uh, hematopoietic stem cells uh, uh, have been already transplanted in uh, individuals with multiple sclerosis, demonstrated a, a great effect but also providing some concerns about uh, their uh, possible adverse effects that in some occasions can be even lethal. Uh, mesenchyma stem cells are currently the uh, other uh, adult stem cell type that can uh, uh, be uh, translated into a clinical trial based on their ability of uh, providing neuroprotection and uh, uh, inhibiting the autoimmune attack to myelin and uh, based on that uh, they are going to be uh, uh, soon uh, uh, exploited in an international clinical trial that will be uh, uh, that will start in the next year uh, neuroprecursor cells are a very interesting and promising uh, type of adult stem cells that uh, can uh, uh, probably provide a superior uh, effect in terms of uh, uh, capability of engrafting within the central nervous system of the individual with multiple sclerosis and therefore provide trophic factors that modulate immune responses and protect neurons being inside the central nervous system. Finally, I think that uh, a great deal of expectation will arise from the uh, exploitation of uh, uh, embryonic uh, stem cells and uh, IPS uh, induced pluripotent stem cells will be one of the next frontiers. In this case, we could overcome uh, the, all the issues related to uh, ethical aspects or religious aspects and possibly utilize cells that will acquire embryonic, uh, uh, embryonal uh, uh, features uh, it, that will be uh, mainly uh, interesting as a possible treatment for uh, tissue repair based on their ability to differentiate into neural cells. So I think that uh, in the next future we will have a, a quite significant uh, uh, advantages in using stem cells for the treatment of multiple sclerosis. I doubt this can be the cure of multiple sclerosis and unfortunately at this stage we are still uh, uh, unable to utilize stem cells to fully restore uh, irreversibly damage uh, uh, CNS, but on the other side, we can indeed uh, uh, provide a, a, an effective treatment for those individuals that are not fully responsive to currently available therapies.